Now then guys, how are you doing? Back on the road again, and today me and cameraman, oh, we're in that there Scotland, told Edinburgh, and we're heading to a place called Down the Hatch. Now, I'm thinking, Down the Hatch? I'm too fat to get down hatches, me, you know what I mean? I'm going to get stuck. Eh? My big bad belly trying to get through hatch is done, but this place apparently is knocking out some of the best food in Edinburgh. I want to go check it out. So you guys better be right, because I'm hungry today, and I'm looking for some Scottish grub. Let's go. Down the, down the hatch, going down the hatch, down the, down the hatch. Da, 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 da. Hey, oh, holiday in. I can be in a holiday in. Playhouse, get in there, cameraman. See you on big screen. Right, so, it is saying, oh, this is down one of these little side streets down here. Let's hope we can get parked up, cameraman. Right, at traffic lights, it's saying turn down here. It's here, down the hatch. There you go. Down, is it a fish shop? It's like an anchor. Is it down the hatch? Permit holders or pay at machine. Yes, I'll be able to get in there, I reckon. I reckon I can get in there, cameraman. We'll soon see you, won't we? Right next to the feds, look. <laughs> we can get arrested by police. Oh, Paul's here. Do, do, do. Listen to it squeaking. It's no here. So the van's thinking, give me a time to breathe, Dan. I'm going to be careful here, Cameron, because I've got to get out of this door. Well, that should do. That should do it, shouldn't it? You know that, that? Yeah, I'm proud of that. Until we get outside and find out I'm 18 mile off. Right, pay it machine. Oh, four hours. I bet this is another nine quid. Absolute fortune here. Right, let's go see what's happening down the hatch. Here we go. Squeezing out. Oh. Moment to play it up, Scotch here, cameraman. We should have seen that. Eh? We should have seen that, mate. Blinking dog pool all down here. Going to jump over it. Right, this is going to be a tricky one. Eh? Oh. Here we go. Can't get it off. Might be in trouble here, cameraman. Might be in trouble here. We got it. Oh, we yeah. Right, tiny sand. Oh, there we go. Ping. Oh, way up. There we go. Feel like I'm burgling van. Ah, sorted. Right, go sort this out. See what's happening. Let's get down hatch. Woo! Ding, 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 ding. Right. Look, every time I come somewhere, just ambulances all the time. It's a sign. Right, here we go. Down the hatch. Out of boot. Slushies to go. Oh, look at this. I'm going to look at menu out here first, guys. Hey, oh! Look at that! Woo! <laughs> right, hot drinks, wine, cocktails. Putin. Oh. Here we go. What is that? Sandoz? What's Sandoz? What's Sandoz? Oh, that's what that is. We've got burgers, the squealer, shaved roast beef, horseradish, seared flat feather blade steak with the Montreal steak spice seasoning, sliced greens, peppers. Oh, this just looks good. Right, come on. Let's go, see what's happening. Oh, look at this, guys. Huh? Oh. It's okay, mate. Look at this, cameraman. I love you, right? I'm very, where are you from? I'm from Canada. I'm going to say, not from Scotland, are you? From <laughs> Canada. I like that. So, is this what all this is about? All oh, ice hockey, Canadian bar, that yeah, type of thing? Yeah, you bet. There's a few teams missing. Is there? But, yeah. What's your favourite team? The Calgary Flames. And are they here? Yeah? that's missing. Is that the one that's missing? Why have you nicked the shirt? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. So, I've been recommended to come down and try mm. things out, but I've heard that you've got a few sandwiches on the menu. Yes, I do. So, what, what do you recommend? What's the best? sandwiches and maybe do the beef dip with the yeah. side of our poutine. Right. Yeah, that's a Canadian dish. Yeah, and um, what, what other sandwiches have you got? We have the squealer, which is on a sandwich bread, and then we also have a Montreal cheesesteak, which is on the long hoagie bun. On a long what? On the long hoagie bun. Hoagie bun? Yeah. What, like hoagie? Oh, I'm thinking yogi bear, <laughs> not hoagie bun. Uh, do you know what? I think I will, that sounds good. I think I'll try the beef dip. Okay. Good choice. And I'll try the squealer. Okay, sounds great. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, instead of 
the protein. Do you do mac and cheese? Yes, we can do a mac and cheese. We yeah. have our mac and cheese special today, which is a fried mushroom. A what, fried mushroom? Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay, we're doing that one. Definitely. Okay, sounds great. So I have the beef dip and the squealer with yep. the side of mac and cheese. Yep, and then can I just get some tap water as well, yeah, please? Yeah, right. love it. a bottle over. How much is that, love? That over. And we'll just go grab the... Thank you. When she said on a hoagie, I thought she said on a yogi. <laughs> Get on a yogi bear. No, we're not on a yogi bear. All right, that is 30 pounds, 75. Oh, I love your accent. All right. <laughs> All right. That's brilliant. It's the hard R. Sorry, what is it's it? going to have to go through a few times here to confirm. There we go. There we go. Thank you. Do you want to have a bill? If you've got one, please, yeah. Okay, I can do that. Just print it as all right. That's brilliant. Thank you. There you go. So I'm going to set my table and chair up outside if that's all right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Brilliant, Bring thank you. you. Right, come on, let's go get set up and talk Cheers. about this. Thank you very much. Cheers, love. Oh. Sorry, guys. Thank you. Hoagie, hoagie, bear. <laughs> well, let's see if me right off guard. Do you know what it is? The accent, the accent proper like did me in. I was expecting obviously Scottish. Hi, you. Hiya, mate, you all right? Welcome, thank you, mate, thank you. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. Yourself? Happy New Year, happy new, by the way. Happy, happy new, new Year, happy New Year. What's good round here? Cause I've just got here. I'm yeah. trying this place. I've not got a clue. You've not got a clue? I've been looking for 30 years. You've been looking for 30 years. <laughs> well, if you find something, drop us a message. Will do. Hey, guys, thank you. Mate. Cheers, mate, thank you. Right, let's get this on a minute. There we go, cameraman. How's that for you? A bit further back. You want me, want me snug in? Snug in? Is that all right for you? Right. There we go. He's been, he's been, been looking for 30 years, has that lad? Yeah, Still haven't found no way good. Right, let's get old Knacker Cracker away. So, it is a Canadian bar slash restaurant. You've got lots and lots of uh, obviously ice skating, ice skating, national sport in Canada, isn't it? You know what I mean? Oh, right, here we go. Oh, chair test. And here we have it. Yeah, so you can see my eyeballs. Cameraman says, it's all right with that cap on. Says, we need to put it behind your big lugs a bit so I can see your eyes. Is that, is that better? Uh, I bet I look like handicap now. Right off at newspaper, back at newspaper. So it's the sandwiches that I've come for. People, when, I, when I've seen the messages, people say, when you go, try these Canadian sandwiches because they're absolutely banging. But also they do a special mac and cheese. That's why I said to her, what about mac and cheese, love? So, the sandwiches, the price of it, 30 quid, all right, seems to be the sort of a bit of a feel in Edinburgh, 30 quid. All right, but I've got two sandwiches, the world famous beef dip and the squealer. All right, now the, the beef dip, that intrigues me because I've had something similar before, which was, I think, was called the French dip, which was when I was in LA. And I got took there by Toll Phil, he says, you've got to try that out. And I tried that and it was amazing, to be honest with you. So I'm hoping that this is going to be up to scratch. And then I have got the uh, mac and cheese, which is six quid. So 12, what was it? 12.75 foot beef dip, 12 quid foot squealer, six quid foot mac and cheese. Not bad. Not bad. I don't mind paying about, you know, for a sandwich, if it's decent, it's got a decent amount of filling. You know, it's, it's, it's like a burger, isn't it? I don't mind paying 12 quid for a burger. I'll tell you something, you, you've got to be on your toes here in Edinburgh because you ain't just got buses and cars and all that back, so you've got tram coming up and down the road. It scared me to death earlier on. Oh, it's a tomato. I wonder why it's a taste of Italy and they've got an apple with a bit, aren't it? But it's a tomato. It's a bit weird, just talking random stuff. So we've still got the Christmas deckies up. Ho, 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 grab and go. <laughs> I'll tell you something, so like coming down this road where two trams are going, all right, the, the, the buildings and that down here, there's... Hey, oh, okay, I figured you you'd need something to wash all of the stuff with. Wet so the whistle. That That's what I call it, wet the whistle. Oh, okay, perfect. <laughs> now I'm learning things. There you go. <laughs> okay. You'll be like that, I need to wet the whistle, guys. I'll be like, what are you about? Thank you, love. Thank you. Right, here we go. We've got a big bottle here, a big bottle of water. Huh? Let's get this here, look. Let's bob this over here. Oh, I'm a bit worried about having that big bottle on my table. Fine, I better knock it flying now. Right, let's wet the whistle. That's what I call it, wet the whistle. Oh, okay, perfect. When I said that to her, then wet the whistle, so I looked at me, what? <laughs> what are you talking about? So look at the amount of chim chimneys up there, cameraman. Oh, two, four, six, eight, ten, there's about, about 20 on that roof there. Little spouts coming up. 
I wonder if they've all got like old old, old style fires in the bedrooms. <coughs> for this beautiful food dripping with cheese and all sorts of stuff and then I look up and it's Powerhouse Fitness there you go look at that Europe's number one for home fitness that's one shop I'm probably never going to go in in my life if I'm honest with you never been into fitness <laughs> down the hatch so I'm wondering if like down the hatch is that some kind of ice skating terminology not ice skating you know what is it not figure skating Ice hockey, that's the one. Is it some kind of ice hockey terminology? Did I say ice skating earlier on when I was saying national sport, ice skating? Ice skating, national sport in Canada, isn't it? <laughs> Does it you know what I mean? I meant like ice hockey, the brute, aren't they? They're, they're, they're absolutely nuts doing I've, I've watched it. What do all that film I watched when I was a kid? Mighty Duck. Mighty Ducks. That were good. That showed you. Pulling shirts over head, smacking them in teeth. Yeah, well, I hope he's got tartan flat cap on. We've seen one of them bad boys while I've been strolling. So I feel like I'm having dining for one here, bottle of wine, but alcohol free and colour free. Yeah, not even white wine is that colour. What a, mind you, if it were a bit tinged like white wine, I'd, th I'd think somebody weird in a bottle, if I'm honest with you. Let's get it filled up. Get it filled up ready. Well, 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 well spread it off. <coughs> I'll be going down the hey, oh, whoa, whoa. have we got him here? Well, what do we have? We have the squealer is the square. The squealer is the square. Oh, is that the mac so and that's cheese? The beef dip. Oh, is it? This is the beef dip. That pairs with this one. And then so that pairs the with that one. That's the squealer. And at the bottom. What's that? Right. Like what chocolates? <laughs> they might not taste is that the mac and cheese? And is it? Yeah. Is there wow. Else I uh, no, I think that'll be that'll that'll be that'll be the lot. Yeah, thank you very much. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you, lot. Right. Well, look at that, guys. Look at the size of mac and cheese. Right. Let's get these out here. So down the hatch. Down the hatch. Whoa, look at that. So we're gonna have to see what we're gonna have to do. We'll have to put one of these out. Get rid of this foil. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that bad boy. I'm going to put that like that. Eh? Look at this. I'm going to set the signage up for him. These guys are not going to know what's hit him. Bit time I've done. So, nicely wrapped bits of foil. But as we know, the foil makes the sandwiches. Oh my days. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. No, I'm not kidding you. Like I said, I have one of these in LA and it is smelling as good as the one I had in LA. And then we've got beef. Oh my days. Whoa. Beef dip gravy. That smells a bit uh, herby. It smells a bit herby. All right, mate. Yeah, come scan, pal. Thank you, pal. Thank you. Right, so we have some cap. Is that high enough up? I don't like All right, Wally now. Mac and cheese with mu oh. oh. I did not expect that. So we've got mac and cheese. Crispy fried onions. Looks to be a bit of chive. A bit of parsley. We've got some pesto. And then we've got some deep fried mushrooms. Crispy onions. This looks good. So let's get into the mac and cheese first. Oh my days, look at that. Nice cheesy sauce. Oh, that pesto smells good. Nice green pesto. Oh my days. So that's mixed in with the mac and cheese as well. That is just absolutely banging. Full of flavour. Then you've got What's in this mac and cheese? Okay, so it's the crispy fried mushroom, 
with some garlic and basil oil yeah. and finish off with some parmesan and crispy onion. Yeah, and is, is that is that some uh, what they call it? I've lost my lost my train of thought. Pesto on there. Is that what that is? Sorry, what? <laughs> this this green stuff, is that pesto? Uh yeah, so that's the garlic and basil oil. Yeah. Garlic and basil oil. Bit of pesto. Yeah. <laughs> can you not can you understand what I'm saying? Sorry, what? <laughs> Yes, I can. No, you can't. Look at you like, yes, I can. <laughs> no, it's beautiful. Thank you very much for that. I just want you just to, to deal. It. Thank you. <laughs> right, covered in cheese sauce with a garlic and basil oil. Best do. And then, deep fried crispy mushrooms. Oh, my. Oh, my God. I've got to say, for six quid, the flavour in that and the amount you get, that is absolutely amazing. That is bang on. Look at this, good weather. <laughs> Out here, woo! <laughs> Cameraman's going like this, and I'm thinking he's thinking about weather, and he's thinking, no, heading my price is six quid, you've done well. Yeah, all right, sorry, mate. Right, I'm going to go with a squealer first. So, looks like we've got some nice toasted sourdough bread. We've got bits of bacon, oh my days, chips, cheese, oh, this looks, I love a good sandwich, this looks like a good sandwich. Oh my days, oh there's a bit of chilli jam, oh, a bit of spice coming through, fried bread, wow, nice crispy bits of bacon, seasoned fries, that guys, cheese, it's got a bit of a kick to it. All right, guys. Not bad, thank you. But a bit of a kick to it with that chili jam. There's a nice bit of heat coming through. But I'm telling you, that is absolutely gorgeous. Wow. Oh, my days. Oh, starting to bend my mouth now, though. So, cops have let us go. Now we've got parking inspectors going to slap a ticket on the table. Right. This is the bad boy. Here we go. So you've got your thin bits of beef. Here look. Bit of a mustard dressing. Fry oh look at them. Look at them fried onions. Shavings of beef. On a lightly toasted soft bun. It smells honest to God when I open this up, the smell it means face. It was like a kipper jumping out and whacking me. Whoa! Oh my days. Oh my days. Oh. The flavour. The texture. There's cheese on there. Oh my god. That is absolutely banging. Sometimes with a beef sandwich, people cut it too thin. The thin slices of beef allows you to really get the flavour. Right, it comes with a beef shoe with a beef dip. Now this has got a bit of a herby smell to it. It's not a thick gravy, it's watery. Let's try and stir it up a little bit because I've had it sat here. No, it's right, because it's a you, that's how it should be. Let's dip. Get that sandwich in there. Oh, my days. It soaks it up like a monster. Oh, like a gravy monster. Oh. Oh. Oh, that. Oh. Get that down there. Let me look at that. Oh. That. Wow. That adds a new, you dip it in, it's like bread cake, has a big slurp, you bite into it, it's down one of my chins, or three of them. That gravy is absolutely amazing. Woohoo! Sandwiches, baby. Right, let's go through this. I've been down the hatch, and I've got some mac and cheese, with some pesto, cheese sauce, Bit of garlic, bit of parmesan on there with some deep fried mushrooms. The mushrooms nice and crunchy. They've got a nice crunch to them. 
The sauce that they've created there with the cheese sauce and the pesto and the fried onions, absolutely bang on. With that macaroni, that is a meal in its own. Excuse me, guys. Woo! That is absolutely fabulous, right? Then I moved on to Squealy. This little bad boy, bits of bacon between some fried bread with some spice chips, bit of chilli jam, bit of cheese. This has got a, this pack's a bit of a bite, if I'm honest with you. When you when you hear the word squealer, I thought, is it because it's bacon? It's not, it's because it's making me squeal because it's burning my mouth. It's that good. But, oh, this, this is just absolutely bob on. Beautiful soft bread roll, layers of beef, fried onion, bit of cheese in there, dipped in this gravy, bit of mustard. That is just absolutely fabulous. And for 12.75, for what it is, that's Bob on. So guys, if you've been down the hatch at Edinburgh, let me know what you think. If you've not been, come down, try it out. Definitely get these bad boys. Definitely get the mac and cheese. For me guys, it's nothing less than a solid 10. I don't know what to go for next. Let's have a bit more of this mac and cheese and I'm gonna get into Miss Arnie's. Oh, cameraman. Oh.